Morning, we're in the hole, doing the manhole. Um, I'm guessing a lot of young bricklayers would uh, never built a manhole unless they might do them at college now, I don't know. Um, but if you're on site all the time, it's all plastic and you probably will never do one. We do them on extensions. Um, as Damon was saying earlier, Damon, wasn't it? Um, what's the first bit of brickwork you've done, a lot of us? In the old. In the old manholes, that's, you know, use the old carry on site. That's the first bit you sort of managed to get on and how you, how you learnt your first, to lay your first bricks. But uh, anyway, that's all changed now. So, um, what they work, we do it in English bond. Um, there is a water bond as well, um, which we, the two courses work half courses, but I mean, I don't know, is it worth it? I don't think so. Um, manhole cover in old money is 18 by uh, 24 inches. Um, and that don't quite work out, you work out with holes in it and all that. It's not a problem, you can break the bond up and, you know, it's a quarter bond, that's what you do. Uh, but I just tend to build them what fits. They're sometimes a little bit bigger. Um, and then at the top you can cobble it in to get your manhole cover on. Um, but we're 18 now, I think we're uh, 26 inches across there, so we've got a cobble in, um, just two inches, so about three quarts down we'll cobble it in. Now, we're, for rodding access, you always rod upstream. I mean, sometimes you're stuck on a job and you've got to do rodding, you rod downstream. But all you do, if there's a blockage there, you're just making it worse, really. So you rod upstream um, to release the pile of shit up there, whatever's up there. So when you're cobbling, if you're going to rod from this way, your cobble's got to be this side, because you, otherwise you're closing this in and it's difficult to get your rods in. So, you know, we cobble from that side. Um, oh, well, look. Nice turd just gone down there. And um, we're going to get out this high and then do the benching. Uh, right, and I'll, I'll show you that when we get to it. Dame's just starting doing the benching. Um, we use a three and one. You can use up to two and one mix. Uh, the idea of the benching is so you've got a clean, sort of non slip surface. So if the manhole does uh, back up and full up, you know, you can rod it or whatever, jet it, clean it, and then chuck the bucket of water down there and clean all the debris off it. The other reason um, why you do it, and if you said, it's what Damon's doing, the slope he's doing, there's no shelf on it. Um, the reason that is to stop rats um, nesting on there, um, because they will do. If there's a platform, a slight platform, they will they, they will start nesting on it. They can't nest on that, it'll just fall off. Um, and a lot of people don't know that. Um, as I was saying about the bonding in yesterday, about not cutting closures and that, there's a corner there with a bit of a, got a bit of room of it. You just hang over the stretcher that way and that gives you a quarter bonds. You don't need uh, to cut any closures or three quarters or anything. What we do, we get that in there, shape it the best we can. Just leave it a little while and go back over it. You can uh, shape it up with a little bit of sponge or a bit of wood. This would be done as soon as we come out after tea. After tea, exactly. And then uh, just trail it out once again. Just give it a polish. That's, uh, that's all this is getting because... Um, the fuck is going to see it? Well, they will do. <laughs> uh, I used to love doing them. Work of art, really, didn't they? If you do them properly, but... We're under pressure here, we've got 20 tonne of um, Type 1 turning up and all this has got to be finished and uh, you know what builders are like. Do you like that trail, Dave? Yeah, it's a lovely old one, isn't it? Yeah, use that and then there's a, another selection up there I'll show you. Yeah, you've got a, that little there, there one for getting shapes. Got a little duck bill, just getting corners. Another smaller one there. Um, that's my favourite one, old braids. That's I mean, it's old. And it's how they're worn out. You can uh, get a nice finish on them. And they're all there. Who's just turned up a quarter to ten, Dane? Disgusting, isn't it? Huh? Absolute disgusting. Quarter to ten. Oh, is that the time? Yeah. Time you're gonna put a kettle on, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Right, um, 
we've got another manhole here, uh, it's easy to explain what we're doing here. Um, as I said before, English bond, and now we've bonded, we ain't got the room there, but as I said before, we just hang them over, either end, hang them over, there's no cuts at all. Um, as I said before, the manhole covers 18 by 24 in old money. Um, so you can measure that there, 18, 24 that way, then check your diagonals. I've got 29 and a quarter there. At 29 and a quarter there, that way your cover's going to sit on there, bang on. Uh, and that's how you do it, sorted. Right, that's the benching done on the manhole one. It ain't bad, well it's very good actually, but uh, you can get them a lot better if you spend time in it. We have not got the time, because we've got all this tight one coming. Um, and we've got to build this now, so we've got to protect this. So I've put a few of these big nails in there. Um, let's put that that way around. Bit of insulation, drop that in there, like that. Don't matter about that gap because we've got a corbel going there. And I won't, might not get it out, so that's fine. In fact, I might have got a little bit in there. I've got an off cut, we can just slide it out. Slide it out. Yeah, uh, yeah, and that's how you do it if you want to proceed with works. Okie dokie. Muck it or what? That should help us out, that right? tight bit. Was it worse? Worse. Yeah. yeah. 
have to cut one in there this way. Just... Bomb works. What is that? Oh, that should go through, shouldn't it? Yeah, it'll close you. Close you yeah. there. I'll get that one level, eh? Time, uh, trestles and the spot poles all go in the back of my van. Just fit them in where you can. Only if you get time. Only if you get time. Obviously, you haven't got time at the moment, I can see that. Because we are going to new pastures tomorrow. I know where we're going, Andy, mate. I'm charge tonight. Of course, I forgot about that. <laughs> what we've got to do on the other job, Sean? Probably lay some block and bricks, I <laughs> imagine. <laughs> Ah, oh, right. <laughs> oh, it's another cobble, is it? Hey. We're doing another cobble. I thought it was all right. I thought we could get it in one. I don't know. I won't count in. Yeah, 
feeling. That might not work. But, uh, this has been nothing but a pig, this one, has it? Less than two foot there, what do you got there? Two foot. I'll pull it over. I'll put mine over more than yours, that's why. I'll pull it over two foot on the first call ball. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what? Well, it don't matter, it, it'll fit. Take that other one back in, shall we? No, no, no. <laughs> it'll fit, won't it? I'm going to fit it down there. Level. How do we do that? Sean done it. You got the address of that job, right? Yeah. Where is it, boss? Oh, just send it to me. Puller, Puller Memorial. Who? Puller. P U L L E R. Yeah. Memorial. Where is it? High cross. High cross. Where's that? The old days. Where? Towards where? Uh, where? And what is it? It sounds like old people's home, I think. Oh, that was cool. I'll keep an eye on the shore. When I get to Puller's Memorial, where will I find the construction site? Will you drive around the back of it, I think, yeah? No, no, we've got sections off it there. Don't oh, oh, worry, you'll see me there, and <laughs> they're bright and early. Yeah, right. don't get there till ten past eight, otherwise you'll miss it.
more of us. Be safe, bring them all. Yeah. Yeah, what what style of jointing are we doing? Do you know what? This and that, press yeah. and cross. Yeah. We've seen it just being normally with just a piece of <laughs> stick, like we normally do. Have you, have you been involved in this job, Olivia? I've been over there, yeah. Have you been back there since? Is it all ready to go, like up to dam? Just build it. Yeah? Yeah, yeah we we've do. got beams on, we've just got four courses up to dam. Face work. You can have no face with it. <sighs> right. What's that job done? I wonder how square that is. I'll leak my hat if that's square. Oh, do you know what? That's right. That's 29 and a quarter, same as the other one. 29 and a quarter. How did we do that? It's the way you stack the bricks, isn't it? You put get frying so that's how you No, don't put that on it, it'll make it sink. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, here comes the boss checking your work. Oh, God. What did I say? Don't bring that, didn't I? I said, don't bring that. It's all on camera. It's going to make us look foolish. <laughs> Go on then, put it on. Not a lot wrong with that young man, is there? There's nothing wrong, is there? <laughs> <laughs> More luck and judgment, I'm going to show you. Is that that is. all right, boss? Yeah, I mean, I thought it was fine before you made me bring that over, to be honest. Did Race you? of a journey and, you know, best stuff to go with. Like okay. what? Yep. I'll put the spot boards on the uh, van. Have you? What, everything in the house? Oh, you're really quick at that. Cabby, over where? Can do. What the bit we the bit we said we weren't going to take up any eye, is it getting our way? Oh dear. Alright, oh, let's go over there and make it work hard for ourselves later. Thank you, dude. I was meeting over there, isn't it? Let's <laughs> <sighs> have a little go and polish it up.
Well, that's that for today. Me and Oles are done. We are going to have a job tomorrow. A little extension on the school. So um, I'll see you there. And I really need to sort my van out. See if I can get on my nerves now. But uh, oh well. See you in the morning.